In this video, I'm going to demonstrate a large area vacuum gripper where on the bottom there are dozens of holes and each of those holes has an integrated check valve where vacuum does not seal, that check valve will seal off vacuum. You'll see half of the pad is off the cardboard box there. That's where those check valves are going to seal. Again, demonstrating how this works, notice half the pad is off of the part. So we come down onto the part where we engage vacuum seals, where we don't engage those check valves, close off vacuum so we don't lose any flow from the vacuum pump. The large area vacuum grippers we're using for your application are going to be much longer and we're going to have six of them on a spreader beam. They'll also have a series of small vulcanized rubber vacuum cups instead of the foam pad seal shown here. Also want to demonstrate our torque lift. The one shown here is on a trolley platform so we're using a dual girder bridge crane. Using this setup keeps a fully rigid connection. In this setup we have a single trolley connection to a single bridge or what we call semi-rigid. Having the fulcrum point all the way up at the trolley wheel keeps the lift assist below much more stable than that of a below the hook connection. Thanks for watching and let me know if you guys have any detailed questions.